Okay. So, we are buck ass naked. Um, in a scene very similar to MGS1. At least we got some cold medicine. Um, I don't think we need it just yet, but... We can't go anywhere right now, except for in here, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh, here's a node. I must ran right past that. That would not have been good at all. Okay, nice. So there's going to be a lot of calls in this area, if I remember correctly. Do you copy? You must continue your m mission. I've lost all my gear. I need to locate Snake. He was never factored into the simulation. Leave him out of this. I can't do much naked, especially in this temperature. That's true. You won't be able to attack or enter the hanging mode either. I think Snake has my gear. Raiden, take out Solidus and his men. You must recover Arsenal intact. Colonel, are you under orders from the Patriots? Your role... That is, mission, is to infiltrate the structure and disarm the terrorists. My role? Why do you keep saying that? Why not? This is a type of role-playing game. The point is that you play out your part, and I expect you to turn in a perfect performance. Colonel, I just remembered something. What? That I've never met you in person. Not once. Hmm. Complete your mission, according to the simulation. Colonel, who are you? No more questions. We have Rosemary. What do you mean by that? Over and out. Okay. So we can attack, but we can't, like, do the choke out thing I'm gonna do, or whatever you wanna call it. We got the frog soldiers in here. I just wanna check their route. You can tell by Raiden's breath, it's really cold in here. Takes a left. Come on, Colonel, stop bothering me. Raiden, turn the game console off right now. What did you say? The mission is a failure. Cut the power right now. What's wrong with you? I'm not playing on a console, it's sir. A game. It's a game just like usual. You'll ruin your eyes playing so close to the TV. What are you talking about? Raiden, something happened to me last Thursday when I was driving home. I had a couple of miles to go. I looked up and saw a glowing orange object in the sky, to the east. It was moving very irregularly. Suddenly, there was intense light all around me. And when I came to, I was home. What do you think happened to me? Huh? Fine. Forget it. As per usual, I'm not going to listen to the ox calls. Crap. We actually can't go this way, not with that. Not with that sitting right there. Are we gonna be able to get past him? No. We'll have to go this way. Just have to figure it out. Hold on a second. I'm trying to concentrate here. Colonel's not making it easy to do so. Alright, so obviously there's a guy right there and a camera. That camera's gonna be what screws with us. We're gonna go right here. Does he come down at all? Yep. Stop calling me, Colonel. This is what we're gonna do. We're just going to book it through this room. I typically get spotted during this part, but 
I didn't that time. And yes, these calls are getting very annoying. I'm not gonna listen to them. If you've never played this game before, it's just the colonel rambling on about... It's nothing. <laughs> but he basically just keeps bothering you. But essentially what we're doing is we're waiting for Snake. I actually can't remember how to trigger him. I guess I'll take a couple of these calls. Even my patience has its limits. I just can't leave this thing up to you any longer. I'll do the fighting. You can just go home. Okay. Variety level 13. Rescue Meryl. The return of Ginola. We actually can't go back through there, all right? I hear it's amazing when the famous purple stuffed worm in Flapjaw space with the tuning fork does a raw blink on Harry Carey Rock. I need scissors. 61. And that's a thing, too. Your mission is to infiltrate the Fortress Galluade, rescue the hostages, and neutralize Metal Gear before its assembly is complete. Infiltrate the enemy fortress, Outer Heaven. Destroy the final weapon, Metal Gear. Come on, Colonel. Jack, it's me. Hi, Rose. Jack, I owe you an apology. If it's about that conversation just now, I'm the one who's sorry. No, it's something else. What is it? That day at Federal Hall two years ago, it wasn't a coincidence. I was ordered to keep an eye on you. Keep an eye on me? Yes, by the Patriots. You're a spy? I suppose, yes. It's an ugly word. Are you still there? Was sleeping with me a part of the job? I fell in love with you. How could anyone? I can't excuse what I did. I've reported every detail of your personal life to them these two years. What you did, said, everything. Must have been fun. But some things I didn't tell anyone. Oh. Like what I felt for you. So that's why you were involved in this mission. I should have known. Why else would they toss an analyst into the mix at the last minute? I'm sorry. I know what I did was wrong. No matter where I go, I get used. I reinvented myself to suit your tastes. Hairstyle, clothes, the way I moved, things I talked about. You say you love the color of my hair, my eyes. They're not even real. You must have gone over my psych profile with a fine-tooth comb. It was my job. Great performance. Had me completely fooled. What I really wanted was for you to see the real me. It hurt to play out this... this artificial romance. It was worse to lie to myself than to you. The more love you gave me, the more it hurt. Because I knew the person you loved was just a character. So it was artificial on my end, too. It was just a game, not the real thing. Oh, Jack. I feel better knowing that. What? I was in love, or thought I was, with someone who didn't exist. I was trying to be someone I wasn't by loving what wasn't real. I don't know who you really are. The person I knew isn't real. She's not the woman I'm talking to right now. In a sense, the deception was my own, not theirs. Jack, I thought I was acting because that was my job. But I did fall in love with you. That wasn't an act. 
You expect me to believe that? Uh. It's okay. You had your reasons, right? Hey, I understand, but I have nothing left to... Jack! What? I'm... I'm carrying... I'm pregnant, Jack. Rose! What's going on? Okay, this is what we've been waiting for. Amazing how you walk around like that. Snake! Been waiting long? Y yes. Yes, we have, sir. Where's my gear? Right over there. That's more like it. Everything you had when you were captured is still there. Sorry about earlier. I had to use you as bait to gain access to Arsenal. It worked. Why didn't you tell me about Olga? You never asked. Oh. Not happy about that? Get over it. Any effects of the virus yet? Still waiting on that. So, it was rigged by the Patriots? Looks like it. From what I can tell, Arsenal is headed for Manhattan. I don't know what Solidus is planning, but we'll have to deal with it one way or another. There's also a troop of production model rays ahead. How many units? Twenty-five, according to Olga. Twenty-five? Yeah. Can't say I've faced that many Metal Gears before, but I think we can deal. No way we can. We can, because we have no other choice. How? I've stocked up on Stinger missiles. Oh yeah, Olga left this for you. Why? Olga asked me to give it to you. Besides, I'm not a big fan of blades. Move the right thumbstick up and down to make a vertical slice, and left and right to slice parallel to the ground. Move the thumbstick in a circle to do a rotating cut. Click the thumbstick to lunge and strike. You can guard with your blade if you have the lock-on button pressed down. You should be able to deflect a bullet or two. Right, so they give you the sword. Um, can't remember. There's a way to switch between the. Uh, I know there's a way to switch between. X button. Ah, there we go. You hold square. We'll go from lethal to non-lethal. I think if you do a semicircle, you do like a twirl, I don't know. I just want you to screw around with it for a while. It's kind of cool, but at the same time, eh. I might mess around with it, but... This is one of the more fun things to use on New Game Plus. But I typically don't do New Game Plus runs of games anymore, I don't know. If you punch Snake or slice him with it, I think he'll wreck you. Yeah, they don't really tell you what to do. They just kind of want you to screw around. Come on, time to go. They really should give you this much earlier in the game, but they don't. If you run out of ammo, you can have mine. You got enough? Absolutely. Infinite ammo. Wait up, Snake. What? Yeah, what? Snake, have you ever enjoyed killing someone? What are you talking about? 
I'm not sure. Sometimes it's hard to tell the difference between reality and a game. Diminished sense of reality, huh? VR training will do that. No. It was field training when I was a kid. I lied, Snake. I have more field experience than I can remember. It's not VR that's doing this to me. Raiden, we don't carry guns to take people down. We're not here to help some politician either. You can say that because you're a legend, a hero. I'm Jack the Ripper, a dirty reminder of a terrible mistake. Legends don't mean a whole lot. I was just a name to exploit, just like you. People will remember only the good part, the right part of what you did. There's no right part at murder, not ever. And we're not in this to make a name for ourselves. Then what are you and Otacon fighting for? A future? You can stop being part of a mistake, starting now. What am I? What am I supposed to do? Find something to believe in, and find it for yourself. And when you do, pass it on to the future. In my opinion, Snake should be holding the SOCOM. That's and right in the M4. That's just me. Come on. Snake, Raiden. Otacon, you all right? Yeah, so are all the hostages. That's good news. How's everything on your end? All right for now, but there is something. What? The Colonel's last transmission was strange. Strange? How? Just strange. No idea. Interference? I don't know. Where is this Colonel? I don't know. I've never met the man, actually. I'll dig around. Thanks. I owe you one. If there's anything else, call me on the codec. I might be able to help. The frequency is 141.12. Kinda dumb that we don't get a choice in getting this alert, but what I will, what I will recommend you do just throw on the body armor. You just have to pay attention. So you can attack these clowns with the blade if you want. I never do. Hurry up. Hurry up what, Snake? Okay. I don't know. Okay, we're actually going to try the bleed. Don't fall behind. Uh, snake, if you want to kill him, I'm not going to stop you. Snake, I don't like hit you, buddy. He's doing a pretty good job of taking them out. Yeah, I don't get it right, and it's fine. That works too. Snake. Yeah, he's killing them all. Mm. One thing that sucks about the body armor is you have to watch your health. Can't just let, you know, rations aren't just gonna use themselves. Oh. So I always found it odd that they, they made a PC version of MGS2, but not the Twin Snakes. I think a, a PC version of Twin Snakes exactly like this one would be great. Because playing it on an emulator can be a little finicky. Raiden, about this colonel of yours. I found out where he is. Where? Inside Arsenal. What? I've checked out all the possibilities, but I keep coming back to Arsenal. It isn't a relay point, it's the origin of the signal. Hmm. And the encryption protocol it uses is exactly the same as that of Arsenal's AI, the so called <gasps> GW. What the hell does this mean? I think it means you've been talking to an AI. That's impossible. The Colonel probably isn't GW per se. 
GW was most likely stimulating cortical activity in the dormant part of your brain through signal manipulation of your own nanomachines. The kernel is, in part, your own creation, cobbled together from expectations and experience. That's crazy! But it's probably the truth. The virus may be starting to affect GW, which would explain the Colonel's behavior. It was all an illusion? Everything I've done so far? Right. Snake, what's happening around here? I don't know. What I do know is that you're standing right here in front of me. Not an illusion. Flesh and blood. Huh? It's your call. You can drop this if you want. No, I can't do that. Let's go. Where's that hang glider that just... Nice. That was a moving <laughs> shot.